YouTube, this is Muffs Electronics here today. I'm going to be showing you guys my um, eight, my uh, uh, SDR I bought on Amazon. Um, this is it right here. It's just a uh, normal, um, actually it's a normal uh, digital video over the air receiver basically for your laptop. But, uh, you know, via some guys wrote some, so some code to um, unlock it to basically be a software defined radio. So I'm sure you guys have seen these online a lot but um yeah basically it's just got a USB connector on it on one end and on, then on the other end it's got a, a MCS MCX um RF connector for the antenna so there there's this is the the antenna right here this is the the male uh MCX connector and it plugs right into the side on this one hand and then um I just got the antenna uh, hanging out my window right there, but it's a dinky little antenna for a VHF and UHF. It mostly works for UHF and uh, up, so about uh, 440 megahertz and up. Um, and then this is the uh, the SDR software, SDR Sharp, that I downloaded for Windows. And right now I'm just uh, I just have it on a freak random frequency. Well, not really random, but 929.566. Uh, as you can see. Um, and it's just listening to a couple pager frequencies. So, um, well, it's listening to one right now. So I'm I'm able to decode the pager uh, traffic with a pro with a software right down here called PDW. And then I'm gonna cover up the messages. So you guys, so uh, it's kind of sensitive information. It's a lot of hospital stuff, but regarding sensitive stuff. So yeah, so here's the messages. Um, you can see it decodes the bitrate type, uh, mode, uh, time, and address. And yeah, so here's part of the messages. So that's it's pretty interesting. Um, one thing I did notice there is a um, there's a meter up here. Uh, let's see, it might be a little too washed out, but yeah, there's a meter right here, and you got to make sure that meter is reading all the way over to the right. And at first, I was having trouble reading it, um, reading the. Uh, the, the the messages and getting them decoded on the on the software on the PDW software, but it turned out that I had to turn up the um, I just had to turn up the gain a little more on the speakers, you get higher speaker output, because it reads from the um, uh, it reads from uh, the speaker basically speaker driver basically from the computer from the laptop. So yeah, it's pretty interesting. So this is Windows Seven. Uh, I also got it running on um my uh, uh little netbook here that I have uh. Lubuntu loaded on um, it works all right it's a little slow um, but it gets the job done nice and portable um, yeah so this this SDR it's receive only it I, I got this uh, I think ten dollars off Amazon came here pretty quick um, yeah so you just load up the software uh, and you actually have to load up a drive a different driver maybe I'll do a tutorial on that on YouTube but yeah, so that's pretty interesting. So uh, thanks for watching. Uh, rate, comment, subscribe.